In some news that's coming in, the Supreme Court has set aside a Bombay High Court order which had directed the National Testing Agency to hold a re-examination for two NEET candidates. The top court said that while they are sympathetic to the plight of students, a re-examination cannot be conducted for only two students. Let me go across to Minakshi who's joining us for more details here. Uh, Minakshi, if you can take us through what the top court said in this case. Well, uh, yes, I mean, you see, the Apex Court had earlier stayed the Bombay High Court order, which had halted altogether the declaration of results. And like you rightly mentioned, today the Supreme Court has gone ahead and set aside completely uh, this Bombay High Court order, which had directed for the National Testing Agency to hold a re-examination for two national eligibility come entrance test candidates whose test booklets and OMR sheets had gotten mixed up uh, due to the carelessness of uh, invigilators. The Supreme Court uh, bench said uh, very importantly that while they are sympathetic to the plight of the students, uh, entire re-examination cannot be conducted for only two students' sake. Now, these two students had submitted earlier that uh, when the invigilators started distributing the test booklets, uh, it fell down as a result the test booklets and the OMR sheets, you know, which had the two candidates, uh, which they had received, had gotten mixed up. So clearly, Supreme Court in this case is of the opinion that there is a larger issue pertaining to the interests of other uh, students that are involved, and therefore the declaration of results entirely now for the sake of the hardship endured by two students uh, cannot be halted. Doubly. All right, Minakshi, thank you so much for joining us sir, with all of those details.